When an organization is starting to roll out a number of small offices and home offices, they tend to configure them exactly the same way. That makes it easier to troubleshoot. You know exactly the type of equipment that will be at every site. Those standards are usually set by the corporate office. They don't usually let you and the SOHO run out and buy your own equipment. They're usually sending you equipment. That equipment's usually pre-configured. And they're able to know that every site has exactly the same network configuration as every other site. And because it's standardized, your network configuration is standardized. Every site is able to be managed exactly the same because every site is configured to be exactly the same. Your corporate office is usually standardizing then on one big networking equipment manufacturer. So they can be assured that they not only are getting a device that's readily available, but if they need any support at all, they can go to these very large organizations that have a very large support team to be able to support the requirements for your SOHO. For your network compatibility, you have to think about a lot of different pieces. You have to make sure, of course, that the networking pieces themselves can all talk to each other properly. And also, you have to think about your wireless network. Not all wireless access points can interoperate the same way with all of the different wireless technologies that might be out there. So your corporate environment is usually providing that SOHO with a standard set of both wired and wireless network infrastructure. The protocol that we generally use to communicate on our wireless networks today is TCP IP. And in your SOHO, the TCP IP configuration may be set up to be very standardized from site to site. May use exactly the same IP address numbering scheme inside of your SOHO because you're simply NATing to send that information everywhere else. It's all very compatible and very duplicated so that your corporate office can manage and make sure that all of your applications and all of your devices are able to communicate properly across the network. These days, an interesting compatibility requirement tends to focus on operating systems, different versions of Windows. Perhaps you have somebody in your Soho that prefers to use Mac OS X. Maybe there's some Linux users. And obviously, the corporate environment likes to have things at least standardized or supported regardless of what operating systems may be in place. And obviously, all of these operating systems have the ability to talk to each other. You just have to make sure that those compatibility requirements are built into the planning for your Soho. In a SOHO, your backup requirements may also be a little bit different because you have a need to not only back up your spreadsheets and the documents you might work on during the day, but you also have a need to be able to, some cases, back up entire operating systems. You don't have the luxury of having an IT person down the street. It may take a day or two to get a replacement system. So many backup systems in SOHOs are backing up and imaging entire hard drives. That way, if you happen to lose a hard drive or there's a problem with an operating system, you can take a backup from the previous day and simply image and can have a duplicate, an exact mirror of the same system you were running the day before. This makes sure that you're able to not only keep all of your documents safe, but now you have a second option should you need to recreate the operating system that was on your computer. In your SOHO, you'll also want to make sure that your network infrastructure, your protocols, the operating systems, and your backup systems are all compatible to make sure that your SOHO is able to run at peak efficiency.